What's up guys, I'm Mitchell Musso and you're watching me on JSYK. It was Now 4, the Now 4, the Now CDs. Uh, I remember, uh, oh goodness, that Blink-182, All the Small Things was on it. I listen to that all the time. Uh, and between that and uh, the Lil Troy, uh, I want to be a baller, shot call. Yeah, you guys know that song. So, uh, def I think the Now 4 CD was the very first CD I bought. We actually have a, a single out right now that's number two, it's called Shout It. It's number two on uh, Radio Disney, I think, right now or something like that. And, uh, you know, that, that's, that was my dream forever was not just to do music with Mason, which we've done tons of music, which is all garbage, you know what I mean? I mean, it's good music, but it's just like stuff that we can never show to anybody. So, you know, all that's trash, but it's cool that, you know, he has a song with me on my debut album. That was definitely a big deal for me. But I think the bigger deal for me was when I went on tour with Metro Station. So I got to perform with him on stage, you know, every night for, I don't know, I want to say it was like 18 to 20 show dates. So we toured the whole East Coast together. And I got to tell you, it was like just the time of my life. You know what I mean? We had a song together uh, called If I Didn't Have You, uh, which made it to number one. That, that was a really good song. And uh, uh, we shot a music video to it and uh, all sorts of that was a while back now that we're, you know, more of uh, our own musicians and we both have our albums out. I hope to keep doing music with her and uh, between her and Mason and, and Miley and, you know, Trace and everybody else. You know, it's like a big, a big family. Even on set for me and Emily and, and Miley, we constantly you know it's not necessarily making music it's just playing the guitar and singing you know what I mean it's just like being around it you know so it's it's the one place where we feel like we can be creative and have fun you know what I mean it's not school it's something that we all enjoy doing and uh, it definitely brings people together so man I listen to everything from like Elton John to Lil Wayne and, and everything in between. I mean, and as far as my CD went, uh, when I was like trying to classify it in a genre, everybody always asks, you know, what is your music? What is your sound? And to be honest with you, I try to add all elements of music, everything from rock to electro dance to, you know, hip hop beats to keep everybody dancing. And I also love hip hop. Uh, maybe like a rap rhythm, not necessarily rap, but like a rappy rhythm because not gonna lie, you know, I love rap, love 3-6 Mafia, Dre, uh, Easy e but like old school stuff. It's weird because I have an ear for all music. I can't necessarily play all music, but I definitely like all sounds, you know what I mean? Because uh, the more different sounds you have, or the more sounds you have in music, just it just changes it up, you know what I mean? And, and that's what we're trying to do, you know what I mean? Break boundaries and make different things happen every day, so. It's always your older sibling that you look up to and inspire to be like. And uh, anybody in my situation, if you grew up with Mason, you'd understand what I'm talking about. He's just one of the coolest kids in the world and at the same time, a larger than life rock star now, playing for 20,000 people every single night and still is like just the most level-headed kid you'll ever meet. And uh, it's so funny, it's like, uh, Two years ago, uh, he was working at a pretzel stand in the mall, and and now like he's a rock star now, and it's so it's so funny to watch that happen. But I mean, seriously, uh, to anybody, to fans, family, old friends, still the same old Mason. So it's very very cool. And uh, any help that I need in songwriting or uh, singing or when we were on tour and I needed to warm up, just always go to him. No, I don't know. Uh, any celebrity crushes? Uh, not really. I see prettier girls on the street than I do in movies, you know what I mean? So it's, uh, I don't, I can't really, you know, answer that question because, you know, I don't really have a celebrity crush. It's really too many people out there. Oh my goodness, there's so many acting things coming up and I wish I could talk more about it because this would be a great place to, to, to mention it, but it's all under wraps. I'm not really allowed to say anything. I'm sworn to secrecy. <laughs>